So again, this is going to be the lateral semicircular canal, posterior semicircular canal, and anterior canal. Now, the area here that is just kind of acting as a room between the two, that's the vestibule. Okay. Okay. So this one, the interior? This one, posterior, anterior, lateral. Canals. Canals, semicircular canals. Now, on each of these canals, you'll notice there's a swelling. That swelling is the ampulla. So if we were to look inside, which we can't really do in this, if we were to take this apart and look at it, you would see something similar to this. So in here, you'd have hair cells, but instead of a tectorial membrane here, you would have just a thickened area, um, and there's a, a kind of a gel capsule over it. So when the fluid moves, it bends that whole capsule and creates an action potential. This would then go down the vestibular branch of the vestibular cochlear nerve for equilibrium purposes. And then we have two more sensory areas here, which are the saccule and utricle. Saccule and utricle. And those are also detecting equilibrium, but just with a matter of how fast it's going forward or backwards. So saccule this one, uh -huh. the top? Saccule, utricle. Thank you.